Now I'm going to go ahead and just give you one movement strategy that might be super helpful. We actually just take, um, we're going to sit up nice and tall, and we're going to actually have an elongated spine. The reason why that's important is it allows your lungs to open up, and so you're getting good lung capacity and a nice tall spine, but soft shoulders. So you don't want to be stiff because you don't want to, um, you know, create too much. So soft shoulders, nice tall spine, open lungs. And you're going to actually take your hands, and you're going to interlace them like this, and go out this way. And you should be able to feel even just a tiny bit of stretch there. And then we're just going to go up and look up on the inhale. We're going to inhale and look up. And you're going to stretch out. And we're going to inhale. And as we exhale, we're going to go back down. And we're going to round out our back a little bit. And you're going to go and turn your back and go all the way down. And exhale. Okay. And then we're going to go back up again on the inhale. And stretch up. Look up. You can get a nice stretch over your shoulder. And exhale down. I'm going to inhale up again. Inhale. Put your head back. And exhale down. And even on this one, remember you practice your inhale. You want to make sure you're breathing. Inhale up. And exhale down. What you don't want to do is forget to breathe. And last one. Inhale up. And exhale down. Okay. And that, we're going to shake out our arms a little bit. And there's going to be another twist for our movement. And we actually will start with our seated nice and tall, soft shoulders. This time, this is going to be a little bit strange maybe, but we're going to take... Um, doesn't matter if it's your left or right, but I'm going to use my right hand and I'm going to put it on my left knee. I'm going to take my right, my left hand and I'm going to go around the back of my chair and I'm going to give myself a nice pull. So that's sort of the movement. And then I'm going to put my neck back this way. What I'm going to do is go inhale with my hand on my opposite knee. And I'm going to take that arm and go around and I'm going to inhale and twist. I'm going to hold this for five breaths. Inhale through my nose and exhale. You should feel a nice stretch on your shoulder if you're going to pull back with your chair. A nice stretch on your lower back and your shoulders. We're going to hold it for five counts. We're on inhale and exhale three. Inhale, exhale four. Inhale, exhale five. Some of you might be feeling a little popping in your spine. We're going to inhale and go back to center. Okay. So we're going to actually put your hand on your knee. So it's the opposite hand on your knee. So on the opposite knee. And then you're going to take your hand over your shoulder and go the other way. So put your hand on your knee, your opposite hand on your knee. Yep. And then now you're going to take this. Yep. To go on your left hand and that's going to go on the back of your chair. The other way. The other way. <laughs> yeah. That's right. But you're going to go actually twist your body this way. If I'm having trouble with it, I'm sure other people are. So thank you. <laughs> so you're going to go on your knee and then you're going to actually just take your hand and you're going to put it on the, there you go. Just like that. There you go. Now you can use your elbow to stretch a little bit. You can feel that on your shoulder pull and you might be able to just use your hands. You can just twist this way and you're going to just give your, your spine a nice twist. And you're going to inhale for five counts and exhale. So we're going to hold it for five breaths. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, three. Exhale, you should feel a nice stretch. You might be popping your spine a little bit. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, last breath. Exhale, and we're going to inhale and go back to center. 